In our Health Watch report, Local 3's Connie Fellman tells us about a little girl who is a medical miracle. Approximately 4,000 children will be diagnosed with brain tumors each year. The five-year survival rate in kids is 74%, but the younger the child, the chances of survival decrease. So what are the odds a child will survive when the brain tumor develops before birth? Well, here's the story of one brave mother and her miracle baby. Watching her little girl swing and slide, climb and walk is all Emily Murray has dreamed of. I found out I was pregnant right before the pandemic. A single woman who chose fertility treatments to start her dream of having a family until... Took the breath out of me. An ultrasound at 36 weeks showed a mass in the middle of baby Elizabeth's brain. Elizabeth's story is quite unique in that her tumor was found in utero. So we detected it before she was even born. The age, size, and location of the tumor were extremely rare. A teratoma is a type of tumor that contains multiple types of tissues. So it can have hair and teeth, and tissues from all over. And it was extremely large. Elizabeth's tumor was about the size of a grapefruit. Born with fluid on the brain, Elizabeth started having seizures. Before we were able to take out the tumor, um, we had to perform surgery to drain those cysts. Then when she was strong enough, another surgery to remove the tumor. And I said, well, hold on. How much of the tumor did you get? And she said, oh, I think we got the whole thing. Doctors believe the tumor may have caused right side hey. cerebral palsy. But that side of her body has the most trouble with um, movement and muscle tone. Now at two and a half, she's making great strides, catching up cognitively with her peers. And the latest scans show Elizabeth is tumor free, something her mom always dreamed of. It was scary, but it never felt impossible. Yeah, we're going up the big hill. Elizabeth may always have weaker muscles on her right side, but it shouldn't hold her back in any way. Doctors also say they've seen her brain mature and develop with time. And that's your Health Watch. I'm Connie Fellman, Local 3 News.